Here comes the champ. Jacob the Bengal Sandlin from Decatur, Alabama at 10th Planet Decatur. This is definitely exciting. Jacob Sandlin is a really exciting fighter. He's a 10th Planet Jiu Jitsu guy. He's very well known in the Jiu Jitsu world for what he can do. You know, he fought for us uh, before. He fought Seth Boswell and rendered him unconscious with a choke. And Seth Boswell is a higher level Jiu Jitsu guy. So that tells you how good Jacob Sandlin is on the ground. But Sandlin very calm and composed. Now Joffrey to his feet. Back down he goes, looking for the leg. Nice, nice left there from uh, from Joffrey. Oh! And Sandlin comes back with a nice combination. Joffrey, you see the replay here. Sandlin is just landing every single thing. Sandlin, big right, and a left, a nice combination, continues to move forward, 25 seconds to go. Joffrey eats another right, and another, combinations back and forth by Sandlin. Joffrey's not protecting himself here. I don't know what Clint's looking at here, he should stop this fight. Sandlin continues to pummel Joffrey, under 10 to go in the round, will he survive? He does. What? And the Bengal is just stalking his prey in the second round. Sandlin's able to just stay calm and composed in what looked like a really, really tight arm bar. He's got room. He's got him. He needs to reach up and pull his shin down. Now it's locked. It's very tight. 17 seconds. That's tight. Round one. Here we go as they touch gloves. Scheduled for three three-minute rounds. And there's the takedown there. Really, really effective takedown by, by Sam. on him like a wet blanket, you know. He's not giving him any room to breathe. A couple of elbows by Zuniga, but to no avail as he's taken down once again by Sandler. And here's some ground and pound from Zuniga. But just look at, look at Sandler's jiu-jitsu. Look at what he's doing. He's going to go for an arm bar here. Get no panic at this young man. That's going to be it. So going to be a lot of trouble get it. here. A lot of trouble. Wow. Fight's out of it. Boy, I thought he was about ready to. But look at, look at the transition. Submit. Look at the transi transition. He goes immediately to a triangle choke. With only 10 seconds left. Yeah. Time run out on Sandler.
from Salem. Another guy that's extremely, extremely composed when he goes out there and fights. And I think that's something you learn from BJJ because the, the, the matches are longer, you have more time to work stuff, and Jacob's been able to bring that into the cage. Wrestling. He used those double those double unders and immediately took a shot. And he's not out of trouble from that guillotine just yet. Well, what do we got here? Does Jacob have something locked up? Arm in guillotine. He's switched it to the mount. I can't see where his hands are. But this is this is for all the money right now. You know, I actually had a lot of people calling me saying, I want to fight Sandlin. I want to fight Sandlin. A lot of people were wanting to fight him. I don't think I'm gonna get a lot of phone calls next time. Good. Nice, one, Walk. two, one. Walking and him out. down. Blake returns with a left hook. Blake trying to throw some bombs here. Good some uppercut. uppercuts. Really just swinging for the fences now. Oh, oh nice. Salem. Wow. Wobbles him with a left high. Oh, beautiful. 